Thank you so much for joining me today. We are working on a money spell today that is for drawing a specific amount of money for a specific need. So what I have here is some herbs de Provence. You can use another money draw herb mixture or just plain lavender. This is just some plain vegetable oil. You can use any that you like. Olive oil is fine. I have a green candle and a purple candle. I have got some green modeling clay. I've got some sea salt. I've got some jasmine perfume. You can use jasmine fragrance oil or jasmine essential oil or any kind of money draw oil that you like as well. Um, and I've also got a, a, a red pencil and some green paper. And I also actually have some, uh, some green fabric that I'm gonna pull out in a second as well. So you need to address whoever's in charge of money in your country. So for the United States, Great Secretary of the Treasury, I implore you to grant me the sum of, and then you just write in the amount of money you need for the purpose of, and then just write in the reason for it. Then you can trim off any excess paper and set that aside for a moment. Now just take your modeling clay and knead it. It's a little cold in here, so I need to knead it a little extra. And then you're going to take your herbs, whatever herbs you're using, and you wanna knead the herbs into the clay. Now remember that this kind of magic, the, the cruder, the better. So even if you're a really good sculptor, make it somewhat crude. So you want to uh, make a, a torso first, and then a head, then two arms, and then two legs. Again, very, very crude. Then place your poppet right on top of your letter and then sprinkle it again with some more of your herbs. Now set the poppet and the letter aside for a moment. Take just maybe one or two pinches of the salt and put it right into the oil and use that as your anointing oil. And you take and anoint the candle from the center all the way up to the wick and then from the center all the way down to and including the base. And you do that with both candles, both the green and the purple. It doesn't matter which one you, you uh, anoint or light first. Place a piece of green fabric down and place the anointed candles on top of the green fabric. And then also uh, place your letter with the poppet on top of it, including the herbs on top of that green piece of paper. Now I'm just anointing it with three sprays of jasmine perfume. Like I said, you can use a, a, an oil, like a uh, money oil or a jasmine oil if you prefer. Now you're gonna light your candles. I'm gonna uh, drip some wax into this holder so it doesn't fall over first. And then you're gonna light your uh, each of your candles. These don't fit so snugly, so we just drip a little wax, like I said, uh, into the holder first. And then once your candles are lit, you just wanna sit and visualize the money that you desire as if it were already here for maybe two to five minutes. Once you're finished with your visualization, snuff the candles out. If you can leave this set up, that's great. If not, move it away and come back to it the next day. Relight the candles the next day and sit and visualize for two to five minutes again. And repeat that for a total of three days, after which time you let the candles burn down and out all by themselves. Obviously never leaving a candle unattended. Once that's happened, you take the fabric and you wrap the whole thing up into a little parcel like this. And you just take this parcel and you hide it away somewhere and once your money has materialized, then you will unwrap the parcel and you will disassemble the doll and throw everything away. Poppet magic is very powerful and it's actually very simple. Don't let it intimidate you. It's so much fun, it's so easy, and you'll get great results the more you practice. Thank you so much for joining me today. I hope you enjoyed this. Until next time, blessed be.